for less than $20, you can get this wireless UHF remote control switch. How well does it work? Keep watching to find out. Here's a look inside the handheld remote control. You get two. Doesn't actually say what battery it needs, but I asked the seller and it is two button cells CR2016. There are three functions, momentary, toggle and latch. This is the test setup, 12 volts of power connected here. The receiver board, if we look at the terminals, you can see them here. So moving from top to bottom, negative supply, positive supply, normally open for the relay, common and normally closed. We have the positive supply connecting to the common terminal on the relay and connected to the normally open connection is this buzzer. The other side of this buzzer connects to negative. So when the relay is closed the buzzer sounds and when the relay is open, the buzzer is off. If you want it to do it the other way, then just change over this connection from normally open to normally closed. That's the wire going to the buzzer. And then you can have it normally on, which as you'll hear is a bit annoying, so I won't do it that way. There are three modes and they are programmable when you press this button here and then buttons on the remote control. I've already done the first mode which is momentary so that when I press this then depending on which key that's momentary that's a well that keeps it going until you want to stop it where you just press this if you wanted to you could just send morse code with this and if we press this twice you might have just seen the little LED there and then that, it behaves differently. That turns it on. That turns it off. So that's the latching function. When we press this one, it keeps it on. So really you could just use this on button, you don't need to use this one. And then there's a third function. I don't know if you'll find it very useful, but if you press this three times, and that. Uh, the behavior is a little bit different. Um, I think I'll go with this one. The receiver comes with this handy case. 
with a lid that clicks shut just like this. There's a little hole here. If you wanted to get more range, then you could uncoil the antenna. But for short range, just keep it rolled up. Let's do a range test. I'm right near my local oval. So it's a fair distance to the other side, maybe 150 meters. And I've just got the little box in the case it came with. I've still got the antenna wire coiled up and it's just sitting on a seat. So only about 50 centimeters or so above the ground. Just give it a test. And we'll just walk away and see how far we can get. Well, it seems to be picking me up all the way, well, I'm probably about a third of the way across, so I'll keep running and see if I can hear it from near the other side. About in the middle. As you can hear, it's still responding. But in the middle here, it's quite reliable. So what sort of application might you have for this? Some form of remote switch. Maybe if you've got a large backyard and don't want to have a wire. Maybe you could have a battery and a small solar panel. So then this switch end would be completely self-contained. Then you could use it to switch elements in a wire antenna. That could change its directivity. Supposing you had a two element wire quad in a tree, you could have a switch like this and remotely control one of the elements so it becomes either a director or a reflector. So you could just press the button from inside your shack and you could flip the beam direction instantly. So that's one possibility. There's other types of wire antennas that are simpler, maybe just a single wire, but if you change their length or maybe switch in another section of it, then that can change the radiation pattern as well, particularly on the higher HF bands. So you do have applications with units like this to be remotely switching something. If you've got any other use ideas, then please let me know in the comments. Roger, roger. You are 5.9 and running 5 watts. 5 watts QRP. Over. Okay, great job for 5 watts and uh, 723 for the call. Thank you. No QRP. Pussy about QRP. Right, it was great to work. QRP. QRP. Pussy about 5 watts. I am QRP 5 watts. 73. No, 